Hello everyone, in this super quick tip video I'm going to show you how to set a GIF as your email signature, like this. So before I get started, last week I uploaded a video explaining how to create a GIF in Photoshop that you can then upload to your Squarespace website, so if you're not familiar how to make a GIF then you might be best checking that video out first, I'll leave a link for that up there. So let's get started. So the first thing we need to do is get the URL of our GIF. So, I mean, there's a couple of ways we can do this, and this just isn't specific to Squarespace. I mean, you could, if you've got a WordPress site or um, show it or, you know, any other kind of site, you can still get the URL of the GIF. So one way we could do it in Squarespace is to just go to our logo. If we were using the, the glitchy GIF logo that I showed you in the other video, then um, we could just right-click on this and then go to Copy Image Address. But as it stands, this is just a static PNG. So what I'm going to do is upload it in a different section in Squarespace so we can get the URL. So if we go to Design, Custom CSS, and then I'm just going to open this in a new window so you can see what's going on. So if we just make this a little bit bigger. Next, I'm going to go to Manage Custom Files and then Add Images or Fonts. So now we can upload our GIF as well to this section so you know no one can see it. It's not, we're not just sticking it in a page for the sake of it being there. So if we just open that, wait for it to upload, there we go. So if we just click on this now, the URL will be displayed over here. So if we just copy it, delete this then from the CSS editor. Let's just shut that down. And then we come across to our email provider. Then we want to go to this cog icon up in the top right corner. Go to settings. And then under the general tab, if we just scroll down this page, we've got our signature set up here so if we just click to say we want to use a signature and then we want to insert image and then go to the web address url tab and we just want to paste that url in that we got so there we go that's in if we just press select so you see it's absolutely massive at the moment um so if we just click anywhere on the image and we just select our size i'm just going to drop this down to medium and then go to save changes and now when we to go to compose an email, you see that our GIF logo is in there, so it's all working nicely. So thank you so much for watching. Um, hopefully you found this video useful. If you did, leave us a thumbs up below. If you're not already, please do consider subscribing to see more Squarespace tutorials, Photoshop, random tutorials. Um, and hopefully I'll see you in the next video. See ya.